Hello everybody, it's B Wildcat 2. This is the last ever Phillies franchise video from MLB 11 the show. I had this footage recorded before I got MLB 12 the show just yesterday, the 6th of March, Tuesday. And you see Brad Penny, the pitcher, hits a solo shot and the Phillies have a 1-0 lead in the bottom of the third. And then Victorino gets robbed by A-Rod on a great play. This is the World Series, folks. This is the Yankees and the Phillies, a rematch of the... World Series from 2009. The Yankees won that one, but we'll see what happens in this one. Now at 5-3 in the top of the seventh, Jeter's going to strike out looking at this, or swinging at this curveball. Now in the bottom of the seventh, Wilson Valdez gets robbed on a sim similar play by Aaron to this time to his left on the play. So it's 5-3 New York, or Philly, excuse me, in the bottom of the seventh. And then Victorino is going to fly ball into right field. It's going to be caught. Right centered more likely, but the runner tags. Here comes the throw in, and he is out at third base. So that's going to be a double play to end the inning. Now in the top of the eighth, A-Rod is going to send a two-run shot to left. So A-Rod has been everywhere in this video, whether it's been making big plays on the defense or t hitting home runs he's been everywhere but then Chase Utley sends a fly ball to deep left center field and that's going to give the Phillies a 6-5 to five lead here in the bottom of the 8th inning a solo shot for Utley and the next clip we have is going to be Jorge Posada striking out on an 0-2 fastball in the top of the ninth. the Phillies now leading 7-5 to five in this game and the next clip is Nick Swisher going to strike out changing an 0-2 changeup to end the game, I believe. That's, nope, there's two, that was the second one. And now this one ends the game. Wilt Cham or not Wilt Chamberlain, Jabba Chamberlain bunts with two outs, I don't know why. And the Phillies win game one, 7-5 here in Philly. So we go to game two now, put a uh, little game break in here. Game two says, showed Ryan Howard in the bottom of the second doing what he's done all long, all season, all in LCS. Hits a home run to deep right field into the second deck for a 1 0 Phillies lead. And then in the third, Wilson Valdez is going to send one deep to left, and he's got a solo shot, and the score is now 2 0 Philly. There was not much scoring in this game. This is a very short clip. Game two was. You see Ryan Howard get robbed by Teixeira on a great diving catch. Still 2 to nothing. And then Howard in the 8th is going to send his second home run of the game out to deep center field up against the batter's eye bushes. And the score is 3 to nothing, Philadelphia. And now we go to the top of the ninth, where Cano is going to strike out chasing an 0-2 slider. And the Phillies get a 2-0 series lead as we head to New York for games three and four. Much more scoring in New York because that ballpark is on steroids. As you see, Placido Polanco in the top of the first in game three is gonna send us two run bomb to left field. And suddenly the Phillies have a two nothing lead in this game three and a two nothing lead in the series. So this is looking good. Victorino is gonna make a, is gonna ground to first and Tashir is gonna make a great stab at it and rob him of a hit. A nice play by Teixeira in the third to score 2-2 now. Next we have Utley going to be robbed by Teixeira. Another great play from Teixeira. We've seen a lot of those in this in this highlight reel. And then in the bottom of the fourth, Swisher is going to strike out change, chasing a slider on 0-2 in the fourth. And the score now 5-4 New York as the game has shifted that much. But in the fifth, Placido Polanco, a two-run shot to deep center field. Gives the Phillies a 6-5 to five lead here in the Game 3. As that went into the Phillies' bullpen, I believe. Next clip we have is Ryan Howard again. A solo shot to deep right field gives the Phillies an 8-5 to five lead. He's hit so many home runs in this series. He's hit so many home runs in the, in the postseason. I mean, that bounced off the second deck. Now A-Rod in the fifth is going to send a solo shot to left field, and the score is 8-6, to six, and this is only the bottom of the fifth. So lots of offense so far for both teams in game three. 
Next is Ryan Rayburn with a solo shot to deep center field, and the Phillies' lead is just one in the sixth, eight to seven right now. I mean, could the Yankees come back to take the lead again? As that went in the Phillies' bullpen itself. Ryan Howard is going to reach first on this fielder's choice as they throw to the plate, and it's a collision, and he's out. So nine to seven in the top of the seventh inning. Next clip is the bottom of the ninth inning, 16 to 11 now. And A-Rod is going to strike out, chasing an 0-2 fastball. And the Phillies have a 3-0 series lead. Can they re can they get revenge for 2009? Placido Polanco is going to double in the center field for a 1-0 lead early in the top of the first, and that seems to be a recurring trend. The Phillies take a lead early, and they most of the time get it end up getting the win and Ryan Howard still in the first a deep home run to right field a two run shot into the second off the off the facing of the upper deck and the score is four to nothing and now in the third a solo shot from Shane Victorino not the not the most guy that you'd expect to hit a home run but he gets it done a solo shot and now it's seven to nothing so the Phillies are Cruising and Jeter is going to send a two run shot to left. Is that going to be gone? Yes, off the fair pole, as we like to call it here on the Wildcat channel. Off the fair pole. And then Ryan Howard does what Ryan Howard does two run shot to deep right field. I think he had six in the World Series in all these games. Nine to two, Philadelphia now. And then Nick Swisher is going to send a solo shot to left. Scores 9-3 in the 4th. Are, are you kidding me? Could we have more offense like Game 3? Well, I think we do have more offense, but I think it's more one-sided. So, Game 4 looking like it could go to the Phillies. But you see a is going to make another great play, this time of Ben Francisco. And the Phillies lead 9-3 to in the 7th inning now. So we're going along, progressing. And Dominique Brown to deep center field, a solo shot. 10 to 3 Philadelphia and that's when you know things are going well when Dominique Brown who's known for his speed homers into the Yankees bullpen. Next clip we have is bottom of the 8th Mark Teixeira two run shot to left 10 to 5 Philadelphia but that would pretty much do it for the scoring. The Phillies are the 2011 World Series champions. Nice job they avenged their series loss from 2009 as you see Ryan Rayburn fly out to center field. This is B Wildcat 2. I hope you enjoyed this series. We've got another one in MLB 12 to show coming up really soon. See you guys.